Hello friends, welcome back to a brand new video. I'm going to tell you about the Dell G7 laptop which I have recently purchased and it's been about four months since I purchased the laptop. So I'm going to tell you all the things that I know about it. I hope that this video is informative and it helps you a lot whether you should purchase the Dell G7 laptop or no. So with that said, let's get started with the video. So I would say that the laptop has an i9 processor. The one which I bought is has an i9 processor. It works really fast. I would say I have a i5 processor as well in the other desktop uh, i have a desktop as well i have a i5 processor so comparatively the i9 processor really works very fast i must say that if i won't say that it, uh, it will be not good <laughs> so anyways uh, the other key points about this laptop the specifications uh, it has a 1060 graphics card with the max q design it's a ti graphic card so it's a nvidia so the graphics card is a very good graphic card it is able to play all the latest games i must say it is able to play most of the games i have tried at least what i have tried it's able to play it so the point is that uh, laptop has a fingerprint scanner and display is a bit uh, dull apart from that uh, it has a ssd that is 128 gb i'm finding it to less the c drive keeps getting full uh, and it has an extra hard drive that is one terabyte for extra storing space so it is a hybrid hard drive ssd 128 and one terabyte full um, for normal storage so ssd is obviously faster for the operating system so overall i would say that the computer works fine uh, there were a few issues i'll be telling you about the issues in the start so let's get started with the issues which i have experienced so there were a few issues like in the previous video you might have seen that the game works uh, i played forza as i recent force and the hdmi when the hdmi cable was connected the game was working much better and much faster so this was a problem regarding windows 10 with some updates or something and after updating this issue got solved and also i updated the bios so in the bios help in fixing this issue and the drivers also help in fixing this particular issue uh, the Dell support done a good job in helping me fix the issue. So apart from this, there are some hiccups while playing YouTube videos. I don't know for what reason, but there are some times I find that the computer is like stuttering a bit as if it has hanged for a few seconds. So this is another issue I experienced with this laptop. So the third issue I would like you to know is that um, when I export some clips, I mean obviously I am a YouTuber I export some videos so there are some videos uh, that take longer time to export right so while exporting in case you are doing any other work like browsing on the internet watching YouTube videos so once upon a time or twice it happened or thrice it happened with me uh, the computer just um, shut down actually it got hang and there was nothing I could do I wish I could record uh, those clips I <laughs> actually I was in a situation that I was like somewhat panicked so I didn't record that those clips but the uh, computer gets really hot at these at, uh, times like these. So overall the computer works fine the clips get exported very quickly compared to my old uh, desktop computer I'm able to use Adobe After Effects uh, flawlessly. Only thing is that I find the screen a bit small 15 inches I know it's a laptop but um, but anyways I find the screen a bit small when, because I'm used to the desktop computer um, the other thing is that the display is not very vibrant so it is like it has a white uh, matte finish and it is not very vibrant so that is my personal opinion that uh, it is um, not so bright when the other reviewers have said the same thing whoever I use the laptop the battery life I have not tested much but I have noticed I am getting about 4 hours battery life and one more thing is that when we uh, use the laptop on the battery the bat uh, laptop works a bit slower than what it usually does in the when it's in the plug mode when, so that is normal with all the laptops but in this laptop you can see the difference very clearly while using the apps and especially while doing while playing video games and now you can see this difference very clearly so i would say that the price of this laptop is quite high um you could get a better desktop i guess in the same 
price point in case you are investing uh, you should go for a desktop computer but in case you want portability if you portability is one of the things that you require then this laptop should be a good option for you i'm able to play most of the games um, even in the ultra settings in the extreme settings they are able to work uh, without lag um, so one more thing i want to let you know is that after updating the bios to the latest bios recently there were some power plans power plans as in uh, um, in the power plan section there was like some heat optimization for the laptop so there's a cool mode optimized mode and there is a performance mode so in the performance mode the games work flawlessly even in the extreme settings extreme is like one level over the ultra settings so in games like forza horizon i play you can see the previous videos so those games work uh, fine in the uh, performance setting whereas in the optimized mode there were like some hiccups in certain places so overall if you ask me whether you should buy this laptop i would say that you can get laptops um i mean the i7 laptop similar uh, with similar specs you should go for that i suppose or you can get a desktop computer so bros i'm uh, happy with the laptop there are some few things as i mentioned the display is a bit dull battery life is not as high as i expected i mean in the xps versions you get around 15 i mean 7 hours of battery backup um so anyways i found this laptop good there is one more thing i didn't mention before that the laptop is a bit heavy so by the way it's this laptop in case you don't know um <laughs> it's here behind so any bros anyways bros i uh, hope that you enjoyed watching this video do give it a thumbs up and share this video whoever wants to purchase this laptop or is thinking to buy the dell g7 so thanks a lot peace out bros take care i will see you in the upcoming videos peace out just let me know in the comment section uh, which videos would you like to watch okay take care peace out